click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, today we are going to see what is blow molding. The name is very different, blow means air is blown for your molding process and how it is done we are going to see detail in this video. So in this slide you can see there are some blow molded products like bottles or any canes etc. So this are example of blow molding process. Air is blown inside your plastic so that it inflates and form the desired shape which is required. So in this diagram you can see there is an extruder which supplies air to your parison. What is parison? It is nothing but a plastic object which is made through different heating and melting processes but it is hollow from inside so air is blown inside that parison like blowing a balloon. Balloon has been blown by air. The structure of outside balloon is a parison and you can see there are two dies on right and left of a parison. So when your parison is blown, which is a bit heated, it reaches your die cavity, gets its shape and it is holded at that position. And then when the die part is removed, your exact shape can be achieved. So in blow molding, these two steps are very important. Number one is heated Parison. If your parison is not heated properly, it won't get blown. So if more heating is provided, it can melt. And if less heating is provided, blowing cannot be done. So educate or optimize heating should be provided to your parison. And the second step is you need pressurized air so that the parison can inflate easily and reach your die cavity. So in this process, what you are going to do, you are going to keep your die close to each other. Like it should not be far away so that parison cannot reach there. It should be close enough to get the shape of your required object. So let's say I'll give you an example of a bottle. It has a certain shape, but the heated parison gets air. And why it gets a shape? Just because of the die, which are close to each other, like of a certain distance, which are prescribed. So in this way, bore molding process takes place. So in this diagram, we can see A, B, C. There are three steps. One, blowing. Second, getting the shape. And the third, when the die is removed, the final shape is obtained. So in this diagram, we can clearly see how a bottle shaped object is formed by blow molding step process. One, two, three. The three steps are being shown. First, air is blown. Second, shape of the die. Third, object is formed. So these are some advantages, they can be trimmed, flashed and can be reused but the initial setup cost is high. And these are some disadvantages. During the blow molding process, your object get flattened like it takes the shape but extra trimming is required. As it is plastic, it harms the environment and cracks may occur during the blow molding process and air pressure is required. So these are some general examples of blow molding process. So in this, a shape which is hollow from inside can be made by blow molding process. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned with Ikeda and do subscribe our channel Ikeda.